everyone, I'm Lynn with Psychic Focus at psychicfocus.blogspot.com and today's topic is the arrest of Millie Weaver. So someone sent me a question and they asked, Millie Weaver was arrested only hours before Shadowgate was to be released and that was a documentary she was working on. What is really going on here? Thanks. And I put a couple links on my blog itself talking more about Shadowgate, what that is, and also an article about her actual arrest. So. I focused on this and I get that the deep state, they are freaking out with the election around the corner and uncertainty with the polls. They're doing what they can to keep information suppressed. They know that now is the time where if they're gonna get their agenda to get through and they need to gain hold of the presidency, they need to do what they can. So we're gonna be seeing all, all time highs in the censorship and the suppression of information out there. I see that they took something minor and created a big elaborate story to charge her so she could be arrested to delay the release of her documentary. If they can delay her releasing her documentary, they can avoid having names spilled. If they can do that, they're going to. They don't want to have to mitigate any kind of information floating around out there any more than they already do. I see that the documentary is about showing the full scheme of trying to create scandals. It's going to reveal how tangled the web is, and it's also going to list names of key players. I also see it's going to show how Soros has funded one agenda after another, just trying to cause problems from, for this administration and trying to get Trumpet out of office. The crooked people involved in these useless investigations it's going to reveal who they are and you know these investigations have been going on for four years now i get that they don't want people to question the government because their current social experiment that's going on uh, is working full force and there's a certain amount of brainwashing done by the powers that were uh, that i talk about all the time and free thinking and questioning sort of breaks their spell that they have over people if you have an open mind you start to question things their fear tactics aren't as effective. So they don't want things out there that could question what they already have going on. I get this documentary is gonna be a good thing. It's gonna open many eyes. I wish her well and I hope that she sees her mission through. So love, light, and free speech to all of you. Thank you so much for listening. I'd be curious your thoughts, what you've heard about this or what your feelings are. Uh, again, I'm Lynn with Psychic Focus at psychicfocus.blogspot.com. Thank you, bye.